having a bad idea if they have percent damage if they have a pick left. Yeah, but they had tank pick left, so that's usually less bad. Like, there's not many tanks with heavy percent damage. Tank monk. That would have been good. No one does that except me, though, so we're safe. Tank Monk would have been really good, actually, for them. Does Artanis not have a talent against CC? Not really. I mean, your E gives you unstoppable, so that's basically how you counter CC with this hero, but like you have to hit it, and you have to hit it before they hit you. <laughs> so it's not that easy. If you miss, you just die. Stacks worth. Okay, I'll give you the glow, but you better give me like 70 stacks. If you kill the Rexstar, you get 10 stacks. You mean Misha? If you kill Misha, you get 10, yeah. I think you get 10 if you kill Rexstar too. Do you get 10 or 20 if you kill Rexstar? That I'm actually not sure. Maybe you get 20 because both of them die. Not sure though. Dames. Oh, you know it. It's dinging time. Uh, I think I only got 10 there. I think it was only 10. Soggy Rice, thanks for the 44, by the way. Welcome back. That'll be going to Spell Shield this game, though. I don't think I'm going the uh, Info Swap. It's a Spell Shield angle. How do you play Rexar into stacking Artanis? Well, you have to make sure both of your, you know, both the Misha and the Rexar hits the Artanis every time he hits you, your Misha. Usually you'll outtrade that way, eventually. And try to avoid giving any free stacks. Don't fight unless you really have to. This guy is doing pretty good on making sure his uh, Rexar hits me every time I hit the Misha, but he, he gave me a lot of free stacks. He's not doing good on the not give free stacks part.
Getting hard countered by Erel and Zul is it skill issue? Well, those are heroes you'll never kill in the lane, but they should never kill you either. You just avoid them and soak. Some somewhere else. That has block. Yeah, the 100 Zerg didn't seem to do much. They're getting a lot of kills though. More stacks than Vala. Oh, we are scaling. Maybe it does. <laughs> Holy shit, look how long that Q is. Giga long Q. Oh, team ditched. Goodbye team, it's nice knowing you. Down a 2v1 here so they can 4v3. Yeah, I kind of am. This is really bad for them because now they gotta wait for this to 2v1 me. Like, their team's all gonna be dead by the time this is over. Yeah. People kick. That ult was giga boosted. That was a giga boosted by M ulti. Giving me a nice block when their team's getting 4v3. Now they're just dead. <laughs> the alley oop, dude. The alley oop. Chica boosted. We are not doing great on buildings. Yeah. We're doing pretty good on scaling and, and uh, arrow kills, though. It's fine. Not too worried. I guess not. Alright, screw it. Maybe I can solo it. Welcome back, Conagens. Yeah, I hope you've been doing well. Absolutely love to see that. Thanks for the 28. Spell armor. 
very hard for them to kill me now. <laughs> the Stukov tried to silence in the middle of the Zerg, he just got insta-gimped. Why not play dead? Uh, cause he's level 12. It's a level 13 talent. Oh, okay, maybe a little too much. I really wanted those stacks. boss for them. Good enough. What is this Jaina build? It's just full Q build. This used to be standard build, except you'd get like one mana talent at one or four. It's, it's not that unusual though. OBJ boss did so much. Well, uh, yeah. OBJ plus boss on any map usually, I mean, that's a lot of stuff. That usually does a lot on any map. <laughs> 448 stacks in 12 minutes. That's a lot of friggin' stacks. Giga stacked. Stacked for you, indeed. Very true, very 